also had a NCAA tournament game a couple of years ago. So the, right. the basketball, this was the third appearance by a, uh, by, since they made the division uh, one move. Hunter Southern will step into play uh, at, the, at bat here for Oklahoma facing Andrew Hansen, a name we're very familiar with from Cal State Bakersfield, the B-Varsity Live Player of the Year in 2015 for Centennial High School. This is a really good effort, uh, you know, attempt for Hanson to get a chance to go against a very high caliber team. Um, he's had a solid uh, freshman year. He's actually uh, was projected beginning of, uh, you know, back in the fall when they began, that probably maybe be the Tuesday starter, you know, maybe spot start. But he pitched so well in that fall so that he worked his way as a weekend right. starter. And a line drive to center field and underneath of it is going to be none other than the center fielder. Uh, that is Drew Steel Number Seelman. Three. So Seelman is there. Here's your uh, defensive alignment here. Seelman, as mentioned, is in center field. Over in right field is uh, Chance Gusbeth. And in left field is Christian Deaton, who will hit leadoff today. Over at first base is Max Carter. Had a nice game last night. David Metzger over at second. Shortstop Malik Jones. And third baseman is uh, Brian Grojohn, who also hit the ball very well. And the battery of Andrew Hansen and Jake Ortega. So one away here. And that brings up number three, Cade Harris, the freshman third baseman for Oklahoma. Yeah, Harris came into the game in the middle of about the seventh inning yesterday. He had a big uh, RBI single that helped uh, put Oklahoma ahead. It was a tie game. I think he had a hit during a two-run inning in the seventh, which uh, put the Sooners ahead 5-3. to three. The right. final was 6-4. So a uh, uh, big hit for him last night coming off the bench. One and one pitch down low, two and one now for Hanson. Hanson was a dual sport star at Centennial, two year quarterback for them, and outstanding baseball player as well. And that's what he does, just like that pitch there. He's, he moves the ball around, he's not overpowering, like Alec Hanson, who's gonna be the starter for Oklahoma tonight, throws 100, almost nearly 100 miles an hour. Right. And, but but what, Hanson, what Andrew Hanson does is that, um, then of course there's no relation between the two Hansons pitching in this game. But what he does- Hanson you know, the pitch yesterday. Yeah, that's right. So what you what you um, have though is you know Andrew Hansen moves the ball around, changes speeds, tries to keep the hitters off balance instead of just throwing you know throwing BBs right by you at 95 to 97 miles an hour. Three which two. Is what, which is what we're going to see from the Oklahoma pitcher. Three two pitch here, and he's going to hit it down the line, left field line, and over into foul tor territory. And right off the bat, Harris is going to end up with a double on a on a three two pitch. Just went with a pitch, you know, again, didn't try to pull it again, down and away, and there's no way he was gonna do a lot of damage with that pitch, he just went right with it. Shot that thing about a foot fair down the left field line, and uh, you know, in the out outfield playing straight away, easy double for uh, for Cade Harris. Sheldon Nusi, the shortstop. Look at the name we talked about yesterday, it doesn't look like it should be Nusi, but it is. It's pronounced noisy. <laughs> noisy, I'm sorry, they just said Nusi though, I think. Right, well, noisy I, is, is correct, I believe, you're right. Now that I'm corrected. And it's spelled N E U S E, so you can understand why the uh, we're kind of fumbling around on the pronunciation here, but it is pronounced noisy. Like you're very noisy in the I, newsroom I half am the very time. Noisy. <laughs> Especially if you ask some of the people that are that are in there. Yep. Yep. And uh, a pitch gets away from Hansen and Ortega and uh, moves the base runner to third. Ball oh. bounced there in front of the plate. Clearly a wild pitch on Mr. Hansen. Hanson now with a runner on third and one to nothing or a 1-0 pitch coming up here. Top of the first here. CSUB in Oklahoma. Game two of a four-game set. Doubleheader tomorrow starting at 2 o'clock here. Have them all live on Bakersfield.com. Ground ball, hit to the third baseman, checks him, and throws him out. So nice, nice piece play. of hitting, nice yep. piece of hitting. That's the you know top RBI man for right. the uh, Sooners. That, uh, Number 42. Just an easy chopper to third, and right. uh, Grote John, just an easy play. Defensively, CSUB played well last night. It came down to some problems with pitching and everything else. Well, the big thing was uh, four, you know, eight walks and two hit batters. Right. Uh, and also, there's a couple of base running mistakes that Coach Bob Macaluso uh, was not pleased with. Uh, at one point, it would have, they were looking at a bases loaded, no out situation, but uh, Malik Jones had you know, ran around second without looking ahead and wound up with two runners on third. Jack Flansburg hits it to the to Metzger and he's gonna throw him out to end that out. So, so Anson you know, does what he does. He got out of a jam. Uh,